my short testimony. When I and my partner Roger Lito Senyar, um, that we are we are dispatched here in Cebu. Uh, we we didn't know what we will going to do because, um, first of all, because of our language, I am an Ilocano or I live in Ilocosur, and my partner is um, he lives in Quezon City, a Tagalog language. He speaks in Tagalog. In Cebu, they speak in Visaya. These are uh, first challenge of our work. We didn't know how to speak and we didn't really under understand what they are going to say. But praise the Lord, they they are they understand us because we are not um, yes we are not speaking in Visaya. And what 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 we are what what we have a um, the main our the main challenges that we face is we didn't know what we are going to do because um, first of all we even one we didn't know who is our um, friend and as a missionary. Uh, I example myself as a juggler. Um, the balls is symbolize myself, my mission field, the person here, and even my partner. Um, there are many times that I want to go home because I have um, I miss my comfort zone, and there are many times that uh, I have been discouraged because. Um, especially when my plan and my will is like um, shaking off my oath, my commitment to God that it is like I am not effective. I am not really doing the work of, of the Lord. I am not sharing his will into others. But um, when I, uh, when the time has come that I have been in the, my lowest part, I feel the love of God because he he used some person, some some pastors that he is there. Just believe believe on me, just like he is he is speaking through me that you can do it. I am here and I love you. Um, and that's why uh, I I keep believing the Lord that he is. Through him, I can do it and I can do what he wants me to do. And that's my short testimony. But I believe that um, you are blessed. You are blessed.